All right. I have my composure. Okay. <laughs> Hi, YouTube. Welcome back to my channel. We are going to take you through a full, like, normal day of what we do. And we just had breakfast. I had strawberries and an omelet. And you had... <laughs> I had French toast and eggs. <laughs> okay, this is Andrew, my boyfriend, by the way, for those of you that don't know. Um, we are going to make our workout. We have hit and core. We're gonna do like something different than our regular hit sessions. So it's gonna be a card game thing and then like a partner thing. So we're gonna write our workout now and then I'll show you guys and explain it later. Here, we'll explain it all too. So I'm gonna take Alani new pre-workout Hawaiian shaved ice. I don't know, if you guys can see that. Yeah, and then he takes creatine. I have Dot Fit Extreme Creatine. Yeah. <laughs> the rain. <laughs> okay. All right. So we're gonna mix those, and then I'll explain the workout in a little bit. machines this is the nitro flex muscle accelerator yeah you can do like a lot of things on it we bench deadlift we could front squat but it hurts a little bit lat pull down yeah lat pull down shoulder press so we're using that for now until our bar comes in and our rack this we like haven't really gotten to work yet but it has like a fly machine and like pull down and like extension and stuff like that so full flex then we have our deadlift platform that we're still making. We're probably gonna finish it today, so we'll show you guys that. Um, we had to get another piece of the board cut because it was, the guy cut it all weird and yeah, he messed it up. So over here is gonna be the squat rack when we get it. It should be coming in the mail early to mid June, I think, right? Yeah. So this is our mini gym, and then those are our plates we just got. We're excited, but we can't use them until our bar comes in. And then this like mat thing area is where we're gonna probably do like most of our hit exercises, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. All right. Now we're probably just gonna explain the workout. This is Gemma, Bubba, Bubba's. Hi. What are you doing? Okay, so this is our workout we wrote. It's the card part and then the partner part. So I guess it's like a two part workout. <laughs> um, so the cards, we did different exercises. So we did two different exercises for each suit. So we're gonna alternate. So if you just got a heart, you don't have to do like the same exact exercise you just did for the next heart. So there's just two for each. Hearts are Squat jumps and plank jacks, we're gonna alternate between the two. Um, clubs are kettlebell swings and straight leg sit-ups. Spades are like half an inchworm, the bottom half of the inchworm to the to a pike push-up. And then med ball slams and, oh yeah, med ball slams are side to side. So we're not doing like straight. And then uh, diamonds are med ball squat and press thrusters and straight leg reverse crunches. Okay, and then if we get a joker, oh yeah, and this is our new med ball. We just bought all these supplies and we're really excited about it, but we haven't yeah, used no, them all no, yet. No. Okay, ball. so jokers are going to be burpees. So if we get, there's only two jokers in a deck. So if we no. get one of the no. jokers, you have to do 20 burpees. It's like a set thing. 
and then um if you pick two of the same card at the same time the first person that slaps it um wins and the other person has to do all the reps for that so we each should have 27 rounds unless we pick two of the same card and the numbers are aces one and then it's two three four all the way up to ten and then jack is eleven queen is twelve and king is thirteen and that's how many reps we'll do, yeah? Yes. We're not gonna add any? No. Okay, 20 yeah. 20 for jokers. Yes, okay, okay, cool. So that's the card workout and you guys will see it, so hopefully if there's any confusion now, it'll be resolved when we actually do it. And then the next partner thing is gonna be um, six exercises, and the first one is hand release push-ups. So we together have to complete 30 hand release push-ups, so we could do like, I'll do 10 and he'll do 10 and then I'll do five and he'll do five to do 30 or like we'll figure out like during that time what we're gonna do for it. So if like someone's worse at it than the other person, they can go first and then the other person can finish for them. Um, so that's our first one, hand release push-ups for 30. The second one is side kick throughs for 40, then hollow knee tucks for 50, med ball slams for 60, burpees for 70, and then we're gonna finish together with a wall sit for a minute. And then if we fall during the wall sit, we have to start over. Start over. <laughs> yeah, okay, so we're gonna show you guys the workout now. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. Love the first card. Are you ready? First show? Yeah. Ready? Yeah. What'd you get? Uh, Seven nine, nine of hearts. Nine you of hearts. have nine, nine squat jumps. Wait, nine plus or no? No, we're not. Nine. And I have seven inchworm to pick push up. Okay, here we go. Oh, through the wastelands, through the highways, to my shadow, through the sun rays, and on and on.
toes till I get up Time is barely on our side I don't wanna waste what's left The storms we chase are leading us And love is all we'll ever trust Yeah, No, I don't wanna waste what's left And on and on we'll go Through the wastelands, through the highways Till my shadow turns to sun rays And on workout a little late 
I keep forgetting to start it. And percentage wise, that's like just as good as me in terms of yeah, caloric for output. To male. Yeah. So we're done. I'm sweating. I feel Hardcore good. Sweating. Natural dopamine release when you work out. Yeah. So yeah, never underestimate it. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna make shakes to get our protein synthesis up. Then we're gonna take the doggy for a walk. The like doggy. 20 minute walk because we just did a good amount of cardio right now. <laughs> And then uh, we're going to probably work on our deadlift platform, so we'll show you guys everything. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Where's the doggo? Bubbles. <laughs> okay. This is where I take all my selfies because the lighting is so good. Look at this. Like what? Because of this window. No, I'm talking to the camera. Hello. I'm telling them this is my selfie spot because the lighting is so good. And I always block the light like this. He literally comes in right like this and I'm like, okay, my abs are gone. <laughs> and there they are. <laughs> and they're gone. <laughs> okay. So. Post-workout shake. Dot fit way smooth. No, oh. this is my go-to right now because I don't like protein or protein bars, but like this is the only protein I'll actually drink in life, which is like miraculous because I just don't like protein. He drinks Dot Fit. It's a third party tested supplement. It's very reliable, I swear by it, and it tastes delicious. <laughs> okay. But I am Dot Fit. Trainer, sponsored, so. trainer approved. <laughs> it's good protein. I did like that protein too when I tried it, so. Anything that is safe and effective. Yeah. Make sure your protein is tested. That's really all I care about. This yeah. is not the best also, on the market. This is not the best on the market, but there are good examples of things on the market. Thing. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. that's a good way to put it. Um, also, I have vanilla milkshake right now flavor because the I forget what it's called. It's like a cookies and cream one. What is it called? It's a cookies and cream like flavored one, and that one is out. And I was so mad when I bought it. So I mix this with Oreos, Oreo Thins actually, so there's less of the fluffiness inside and more of the cookie, and it's fewer calories as well. So I'll show you guys how I make the shake, and then easy do you want to show yours? Oh, well, just in general, adding like a cookie or two to your shake is an easy way to fight cravings because it tastes yeah. like a whole thing of cookies, but it's it only the calories of two. It tastes like an Oreo milkshake, it's so good. It's like an Oreo milkshake, it's not even a protein shake. <laughs> This is like a liquidy texture of it, the shake. It usually comes out like thicker than this, but I ran out of ice cubes. So yeah. That's okay, good. so we had our post-workout shake, and now we are starting to work on our deadlift platform. He just sanded all the wood, and I sat there answering questions on Instagram. It's fine. Um, the next step is to connect the boards, because we have four things. The mats are going on the outside and then like the nice wood pieces are gonna go on the inside. So we have to connect the inside pieces so when people do like a sumo stance on them, they don't like slide apart. So it's kinda gonna be a process, but I'm gonna show you guys how we do it. Um, but this is our first time doing it, so <laughs> we're learning too. <laughs> so we're gonna do that and then we can get to like the spray painting part of it after. So I'll show you guys that now. the top of the deadlift platform and we're gonna spray paint it and everything but 
right now we have the two boards you can see and so we have to just connect those two boards together we're gonna do that with nails and where are we putting them the around nails the, around the perimeter oh, okay yeah yeah and then we're gonna flip this whole thing over and do it so this top part you won't be able to see the nails and then our next step is to spray, spray paint right yeah then we're gonna paint it yay okay let's get going Bye. We didn't do the platform design yet. I said we were gonna, but we didn't because we couldn't decide on what we wanted. And then we, what'd we do? We both showered and we're gonna go to the store and get some food and then we're gonna go home and work and mm -hmm. do the, we, we might do the platform design because we have a good idea for it so we might set it up and like I would like to do it tonight but I think it might be too dark, too dark to do it outside. I'm just anxious, I just want to do it now, you know? Okay, so we're gonna put on our masks. <laughs> well, I'm gonna put on my mask because we have to do that to go into the store. And we're gonna get food, do you know what we're gonna get? Chicken. Chicken and, and cheese, cheese and, and fruit. Fruit, grapes and... Yes. Um, and... tortillas. Oh yeah, are we doing tacos? <laughs> Heck yeah. Fuck yeah. Okay. Oh, also my calories, this isn't, this doesn't usually happen, but my calories are like, I haven't eaten a lot today because we were like so into doing things. So I think I've had like, let's see. Not enough. I've had 800 calories, so I need like a thousand more and usually I'm not that behind. So yeah. I'm gonna have to eat a lot. So I'll show you guys that. I already showed you the post-workout shake. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go into the store and then I'll talk to you later. This is what we got from the store. A cantaloupe, because I've been wanting one. <laughs> the wheat thins. Wait, we're making chicken tacos, so I'm gonna show you guys that. We got these tacos. These are the macros, they're pretty good. That's for two. So I usually have like three and he has like five, right? Heck yeah. And then, yogurt. Er, I think this is the only Greek yogurt that actually has more protein than carbs. Most of them are like the same or a little more carbs. And then grops, chicken for the tacos and egg whites and yeah. And so, cantaloupe. I already said that oh. cantaloupe. Okay, so now, Hi, Bubba's. Hey, Bubba, get down. <laughs> Hi. Okay, so we're gonna cook chicken tacos and then, whoa. Hey, <laughs> Gemma. this is a toy. <laughs> and then I will show you guys Gemma now. Bubba's, down. And then I'll show you guys um, the finished oh, yeah, product. Sorry, I know I While he's starting to cook, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna tell you guys what my macros are at. So, so for breakfast I had strawberries and an omelet, egg and cheese omelet, and then pre-workout was sour strips. I had three pieces. Then post-workout was the Oreo first form uh, shake. And then I haven't eaten since. I had a 3D energy drink in the car um, before we went shopping. And then now the next meal is gonna be chicken tacos with cheese and then I'm gonna have yogurt later and I get to have 37 and a half dips. Here's the finished product. We put the tortillas in the oven for a little bit. He cooked the chicken and we got cheese already and we're just gonna make them into tacos. 
chicken tacos. It's really just chicken and cheese because I'm a plain person. <laughs> so I did four and a half ounces of chicken. That gives me 27 grams of protein. The tacos were 42 carb, seven fat, seven protein. And the cheese was eight fat, six protein. So not bad, actually a pretty good meal and it's really fun to eat. Okay, we just ate dinner, I showed you the chicken tacos and now we are going to create our design on our deadlift platform. So we're gonna just like, um, tape it, right? Yeah, we're gonna use tape to make a stencil. Yeah, we're gonna, yeah, exactly. <laughs> we're gonna use tape to make a stencil on the board and then tomorrow we're gonna paint it. Yeah. almost 11 and I'm gonna have one of my two snacks that I still have to have. I'm gonna have wheat thins. I had like, I'm gonna round it to eight before so I can have 30 more right now and then later I'm gonna have yogurt. We don't really go to bed until like two right now because Corona. Yeah, Corona. <laughs> um, so I don't like to eat my last meal like really, really late, like past 12. I try to keep it like before 12 or at least before 12.30. So today was a weird day with eating because I like had a good amount for breakfast and then like post-workout and then I didn't eat for a long time. So it kind of threw my macros off a little, which normally doesn't happen. So I hit my protein. So I tracked everything in my fitness file. I hit my protein goal. I'm under 40 for carbs, 40 grams. And then for fats, I went over five. Yeah, I went over five. So it equals, I mean, my calorie goal is like a little bit under what it should be. So I could probably do, I'm probably gonna do the yogurt, which I tracked, and then I'm gonna have some fruit that's like not a lot of calories, and it's carbs, which is what I'm missing. So I'll do that, and that's my last meal. And tomorrow, I'm probably gonna show you guys the rest of making um, our deadlift platform, like the painting process, because that's gonna be the fun sick. process. Yeah. <laughs> and then, um, <laughs> I'll probably show you guys breakfast tomorrow since you missed it today because I forgot to film. Uh -oh. And I think that will be the end of the video. I think the next video is going to be a... We have cantaloupe. Oh my god, we do have cantaloupe. Yes! It's going to be a... The next video is going to be a, um, a Instagram chooses our day. A video oh. yeah it's gonna be fun wow they can pick what we eat and what we work out and what we wear and what we do i don't know about what i wear so we're gonna eat i'll show you that and then you'll see us tomorrow when we paint the platform <laughs> Oh,
I just woke up. It's like 12. <laughs> it's 12.30, but we woke up like 20 minutes ago. I did some check-ins and some plans for my website, and I weighed in at 138.9. So that's good. And then we just came downstairs. We're gonna make breakfast, so we'll show you that. And then the last thing you'll see is probably a spray painting. <laughs> editing this YouTube video and he has been Me. creating this for our stand. Now we just gotta put tape around the borders which is gonna be the most yeah thing. Yeah, so we have to cut this tape, right? This tape. This tape so it fits in these letters. Yep. We how long did this take us? 30 oh, minutes? Yeah. 30 minutes this took us. Look at all those tape marks. We had to get in the little creases and shit and it was the hardest thing I've ever done. Is it? No. <laughs> but it, it was just tedious and annoying. But this is what it's gonna look like. We have to cover the whole board now except for like inside the outlines and stuff. Okay, so we're gonna do that and then we can spray paint. Yay! This is gonna look sick. Yeah. Let's do it. This? Yeah. Do it up. Yeah. painted the red on the sides where the plates are gonna be on the like barbell so now we can uncover it because it's sat for like a few hours and then we're gonna spray the what lacquer lacquer yeah yeah lacquer over like the whole board to make it shiny heck yeah all right we're gonna reveal it go for it Okay, this is it. Wow. Oh my god. This looks so good. It looks sick. Yay! Final product. Well, the lacquer is gonna go on so it's gonna be shinier, but besides that. Final product. Hell yeah. Here is the final product with the sides attached with the lacquer. This is what it's gonna look like. It looks sick. You can ooh, you can kind of see the fumes a little because we just sprayed it. So, but yeah, this is it. So we just finished working out. I'm gonna end the video here. The next video is gonna be a Instagram chooses our day. Right? Yes, she said I'm that. I'm excited about it. I okay, was in he's not really excited about it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. so we're gonna do that next. Um, this video should be out like the beginning of the week, starting on. The 18th, so probably like Wednesday or Tuesday if I decide to do it a lot on Monday. So, if you haven't already, subscribe to see more videos and like this video. If oh, is you there going to be like a little box to like and subscribe? Like yeah. Right, we put it right here? Yeah, we'll put it right there. <laughs> like and subscribe right here. Okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Alright, we'll catch you in the next video.